Today I'll be showing you Paula by Envy in the color light brown. Hi guys, welcome. So today I'll be showing you Paula. She is new by Envy. Envy just came out with three new styles for spring of 2023. And this is one of them. I've already shown you Billy. So now this one is Paula and I have one more to show y'all and that's Lisa. And Lisa is my personal favorite out of the three. And it's just because it leases a little longer and I prefer longer hair on me. But for you short hair gals that love your short hair, I have a feeling that you're really going to love Paula. I'm bringing you this review in partnership with Envy. So let's go ahead and talk about this cute little style here. Now, as you all know that I normally do not wear this short of hair, but you know, she's cute. She She's really, really cute. And uh, for those of you ladies that really love your short hair or you guys that really love, you know, your short hair, because this one most definitely, I can see a guy wearing just as well as a woman, to be honest. Paula is an asymmetrical crop. And from what I can see, she, she looks like she has some waves in it. You know, there's some waves going on as where Billy, the, the first one that I reviewed, she was more straight and kind of just sleek. This one looks like she has some waves in it. And I could see even if if a guy would get this one and just really cut it up, you know, cut the top just a little bit more and poof it up up here <laughs> or spike it up or whatever the guys do, I can really see a guy wearing this one as well. Paula has Envy Hair and Envy Hair is a blend. It is a blend of synthetic heat friendly fibers and also has that human hair in there. And as I've said before, when those two come together, I think it creates beauty in these styles, in this hair. For me personally, I'm loving it because I have some a couple of human hair wigs, as I've already told you guys, and I have a lot of just heat-friendly synthetic fiber hair. And I really love my heat-friendly synthetic fiber hair because I can go in and create curl or straighten it or just style it to personalize my, my want for that hairstyle that day. What I'm finding with these blends how easily, easily they curl and how easily they straighten. Sometimes when I get a heat-friendly synthetic wig, I have to really hold that curling iron on there for a little while and then I have to hold the curl, let it cool. With the blend, I'm just finding it just works so much easier for me. So if you do decide you want to add curl, onto Paula or any of these new styles. You can use your heating tools up to 285 degrees Fahrenheit. Paula has a beautiful ear-to-ear -ear lace run. So if you're not loving the way I have mine styled, you can easily pull this girl back and get her back off of your face. Now I do have some styling product on Paula here because when I put her on, I just started playing. <laughs> I did use a little bit of shaping cream on her and I just put a little on my fingers and I just went in and just started doing this and I brought her down to like this because she has that gorgeous four and a half inch front up here. So this front is fitting my face shape perfectly. It looks really, really cute. I'm loving the bang down, but I will show you here shortly how she looks pulled back away from the face. Paula also has this 100% hand tied mono top up here. So that's going to allow you to part, you, part this girl to the left, to the right, to the center, so it's just very well done. The measurements for Paula, the front and the crown are four and a half inches. 
The sides are 3.25 inches. The nape is 2.25 inches. And this girl weighs 2.43 ounces. Let's take a look at the inside of Paula's cap. Paula has an ear to ear lace front, a hand tied monofilament top that's going to allow parting all in this area. She has a silicone non slip design that follows the hairline all the way around here and this will hold the wig more securely in place. She has those silicone bendable ear tabs, extended nape with adjustable straps, and she's open wefted throughout the rest of her cap for breathable comfort. And she does have some stretch. Now let's take a look at her all the way around. The color light brown is a two-tone blend of 12, which is a light golden brown with russet highlights. Thank you guys so much for joining me today, but before you go, be sure to subscribe, share, like, and comment. And if you're over on Instagram or Facebook, you can find me there at Let's Talk With Kim. Stay well, my friends, and have a great day. I'll see you soon in my next video. Bye, guys.